카페 문이 열리는 소리가 날 때마다 쳐다봤어. 네가 온 걸까 하고. 난 아직 괜찮아. 아직까지는. 그렇지? 일기장을 이렇게 찢으면 이 날의 그 녀석의 기억은 사라지지. Why would you tear my diary if apparently smudging the words is what happened earlier and that was enough? In fact, wouldn't tearing make it a bit more obvious that someone tinkered with it? I mean, if you smudge the words, okay, you can think, you know, that, that, that's weird. But if you tear it, you can be like, someone's been fucking with this. You're not very subtle, nameless. Not at all. 별로 중요한 날도 아니니까 내가 찢어도 되지? Ah, apparently the only days you should ever remember are uh, days that you enter or graduate from kindergarten or school. Uh, days that your engagement, wedding, birthday of your child, maybe. Maybe you'd forget some of your own birthdays because not every year your birthday is an amazing event. Which actually sounds really boring. You only remember the really awesome or the really horrible pi parts of your life, which... It's too extreme. You'd get very tired of it very fast. 너무 많은 장난을 치는 건 자제해 주세요. 당신의 시로인의 추억이 담긴 일기장은 저도 탐나거든요. <웃음> This makes me wonder what would they do if Eri didn't keep a diary? They'd look at her, no diary to tear up or smudge and think, her memories are in her head. How are we supposed to get them out of there? Of course, After a chapter of one and a half hours long, you stop there. Couldn't you have stopped in between? It seemed kind of too long for a chapter. But no, I'm not going to say for that. Hirona, Chamkurogi Agashi. Again, it was Tay's voice that woke me up today. Uh, unless Tay is very good at uh, making himself sound like a different person, I don't think that sounded like Tay. As said in the previous two videos, the, the nameless laughter sounded like Yonho, strangely enough. I barely opened my eyes and said good morning. Tay smile still looked blurry. Um, Tay, hey. 됐어? <웃음> 아직 잠에 취해 있는 것 같네. No, I'm not. I'm awake. 덜 깼네. 자, 손 잡아. 일어나는 거 도와줄게. <웃음> Tay reached out his hand. And before I could even hold on to it properly, he grabbed me and sat me upright. Yay, you're gonna make me dizzy again? By suddenly changing my position so fast? I felt dizzy from suddenly setting up. See, this is why you wake up and then give yourself like two, three, maybe five minutes of stretching, really waking up before moving. No. You're so cruel. You came to wake me up today? Hmm. No. Ah. 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 그럼 난 나가서 아침 준비하고 있을게. 다시 누우면 안 돼. Okay. I stretched my arms, but I couldn't stop yawning. Uh, strangely enough, 
yawning a lot is a side effect I have with antidepressants. I can't help it, I just yawn a lot if I take them. Oh, so sleepy. You know, I know the bell just rang, but... I'm pretty sure it's not a delivery for me. Nobody in my home is expecting anything, and quite honestly, I'm pretty sure it's for a neighbor, and I'm sick and tired. I've been taking in their packages for years. Kindly go to someone else for once. As I dozed off, even while sitting up straight, Tay didn't leave and kept watching me with suspicion. I think Yuri said something like that about you to me in his route. I'm not going to back to sleep, I swear. Okay. I spaced out at the door. Tay just closed. What? For some reason, I can't focus very well and I feel dazed. <sighs> I feel sluggish for some reason. Uh... Could you be pregnant? I'm just asking. I mean, not that I think that's it. Though if it is, I have, uh... some questions. The tea Tay gave me must have really done its job well. I felt not only relaxed, but also as if all my energy was sucked out. No, actually, I've been feeling like this every morning these days. Since Tay's been bringing me the ZZZ every night. I thought he only brought it one night. <sighs> Let's get up! Huh? A text? I grabbed my phone from the bedside table. Oh, it's from Soy. Amy Kid! Uh, yeah. Wow, like. Yeah, let's go. It's uh, such a surprise to see Tay working there. I can just feel her excitement from the text. She'll probably be more hyper in the classroom. <sighs> she already knows. It hasn't even been a week since Tay started working. But since Soy figured it out already, all of the girls will soon know too. Well, considering she found out, it must mean that she found it from someone else, who probably was a girl, so... They already know? I'm worried. I hope his followers don't bother him at work. No. I guess his fans who go to the cafe to see him will help the business there. Well, I guess it won't be any harm to Tay. I decided to think positively. Tay is always careful and takes care of himself well, so there won't be a need to worry. And I guess it's good. I was going to take them to the cafe soon anyway, so they would have found out. I should go to the cafe called Banjul this afternoon with Soy and Shinbi. Hey, good morning! Red was talking excitedly about something when he stopped to say good morning. What were you talking about so excitedly? Yano sparkled his eyes and said that. Red shrugged his shoulders to hear that. No, no, Lance. The saying is, small world indeed. Not large. Small. Which is why you joined the play in your route without anyone asking. 
Uh, yeah. I'll say it out loud. Lance is like... the most disliked of the dolls for me right now. Slowly followed by Red, but that's because he's just a type that I overall don't like in the in large doses. But we'll see on Red's route eventually. <laughs> Red and Lance start bickering again. I never imagined that this would be how I realized another day has started. That was how much they fought in the morning. Yuri arrived just in time and scolded them. Or actually, he dissed them. Good morning, Yuri! Good morning, Yuri! Good morning, Yuri! Oh yeah, I slept really well in this... What? I'm, I'm not asleep again. Yeah, how about you? <sighs> I would feel much better if I slept the night with you. Wait, maybe is that the way I wanted to say it? You only slept it towards me like a serpent and said that. A slipper threw through the, flew through the air and exactly hit Yuri's head. And as always, Lance stood where the slipper came from. He was barefoot on one foot, but his eyes that were treating Yuri like a vermin were as cold as ever. Uh, depends what perseverance we're talking about here. Yuri grumbled at what Tay said, but he quietly sat beside Lance. As Yuri sat by him, Lance backed away a bit. He obviously still doesn't want to deal with him. Tay must have told everyone about his job. Man stopped staring at Yuri and replied coldly. My honey가 있는 한, 난이 집에서 절대 안 나가. 그렇게 말하는 사람 치고는 요즘 들어 귀가가 늦던데. 도대체 나가서 뭘 하고 돌아다니는 거야? 어른의 사정이지. 지나친 호기심은 고양이를 죽인다잖아. 그러니까 여기까지. Yuri winked and gave us a sneaky smile. Uh, I don't even want to know. Uh, you find out on his route, and it's quite cool. I feel like I'll become the dead kitty. Please stop talking about dead kitties. I ignored his wink and talked to Tay. Oh, right. That reminds me. Can I go to your cafe today? Today? Yeah, I think my friends will have time. Yeah, and even if they don't have time, Soy will make time. I think it's the brightest smile I've seen from him recently. Was he disappointed that I didn't go the first day? Considering he probably came into my room and stared at me while I was sleeping... I wouldn't say disappointed. Huh? I've never been there. How could I like or not like? I felt confused, but Yono pulled at my clothes and whined. Do you need to go outside, Yono? Does I need to go gassy with you? Really? Well, let's go together. 
오늘의 주번 분명히 당신이었죠? Oh. Yano quickly hardened his cute smiling face and pouted. Come to think of it, Yano had cleaning duties this whole week. 주어진 일을 나 몰라라 하고 놀러 가는 건 굉장히 불량한 태도라고 생각합니다. 농땡이 피우는 것은 나쁩니다. 안 그렇습니까? What do you think is worse, playing hooky when you are supposed to do something, or doing something just for the sake of getting a reward for it, like I did in school? Kind of stopped with that after a while. Just didn't pay off. Lance thrust a dagger into Yano's heart. He's being harsher than usual today. I heard the government's been really busy. Lance must be stressed out too. Ah, uh, Master, 미안해요. 저는 아무래도 못갈것 같아요. Or we could wait until you're done with your cleaning duties and then go. There are still a lot of chances, so we can go next time. Master, 네, 꼭 다음에 같이 가요. 주번 일 한번 빠졌다고 불량 학생이 되진 않겠지만, 그래도 맡은 일에는 최선을 다해야지. 대신 다음에 연호가 오면 내가 케이크라도 대접할 테니까 힘내. 와, 정말요? 네, 고마워요. 자, 훈훈한 이야기는 여기까지 하고 아침 좀 먹자. 규칙적인 식사는 피부 건강에 있어서 제일 중요한 요소니까. I don't know about that. I mean, a regular diet is you know, pretty important anyway. Just... Uh, just saying eating meals, though, can be open for interpretation. 식사 준비는 한 번도 도와주지 않은 사람이 제일 거드름을 피우는군. 알았어. 잠시만 기다려. Taesung brought out the food. After noisily finishing our meals, we took the limo again and again made a fuss at school. Brainstorm quiz? 네? The class stirred at what Mr. Eugene said. It's science class right now. Ah, shit. I thought we were talking about the human body. Mr. Eugene was assigned as a special lecturer for the day. Since today's topic is genetic engineering, it does suit him a bit. Well, I guess genetics do have to do with forming the beauty of the bones underneath the flesh. And he would enjoy that. There was a lot of talk surrounding this special lecture anyways. There were rumors about how Mr. Eugene ate our science teacher and that's why she didn't come to class. So he's going to regurgitate her for the next class and she's going to be back? Considering she's not in the office, she's probably on a business trip. Whatever the reason, I can see everyone's pretty nervous because of him. I saw kids flinching at his every move. I mean, there are so many horror stories about the infirmary. Someone even said that a boy went into the infirmary one day and never came out. Sounds like a full boyfriend. Because of that, everyone was sitting up straight before he even entered the classroom. I can see everyone was adamant about not giving in their bodies. They were unnecessarily nervous. I think I'm the only one relaxed here. The ridiculous rumors are all because of Mr. Eugene's weird behavior. He looks way too creepy and no one would gladly approach someone whose hobby is like dissecting. First of all, that's the wrong who's. Second of all, he doesn't look creepy. He's actually kinda handsome. And third... I wouldn't mind talking about dissecting. I just don't want to do it myself. Besides, he even calls Beatrice, his skeleton model, his lover. A normal person would get scared and run away. I would have been uncomfortable with him too if I didn't like dolls. I don't think a skeleton model is the same as a doll. I feel like I can understand them since I also like objects that resemble humans. That makes more sense, but it would also make more sense 
about her being relaxed around him, considering she's, you know, the health commissioner and hence works alongside him quite often. Of course, I was scared of him at first, but after seeing him a couple more times, I changed my mind. He's not scary. Rather... You just think you should never be like him. I thought while looking at everyone's stiff backs. Ma Master, 괜찮아요. 무슨 일이 생기면 제, 제가 지켜드릴게요. He whispered to me, thinking I was scared of Mr. Eugene. But while saying that, his own fists were trembling. I think I'll have to be the one protecting him. That's probably gonna be a major thing in Yonho's route, probably. 알겠나? 그러니까 지금 너희들이 목숨 거는 외모는 다빈 껍데기일 뿐이라는 거다. Yeah, which is why we generally go for personality and stuff like that. 겉으로 보이는 피부에 실망하거나 우쭐해할 거 없어. 어차피 죽으면 다 썩어 없어지니까. 형태가 없는 내장 따위도 하나도 중요하지 않다. 그러니까 애써 노력할 필요 없어. 애초에 내장은 가꿀 수도 없지만. Eugene, the skin is an organ. So. By, like, using body lotion and washing it, we are taking care of an organ. I'm just, you know, saying. You're not quite right about that. Kungbu?ha! <laughs> 죽어서 어떤 뼈를 남길 수 있느냐가 세상에서 제일 중요한 문제지. 아니, 단 하나의 중요한 문제라고 할수 있겠군. Mr. Eugene started praising bones again. At that, one student gathered his courage and raised his hand. 하, 하지만 뼈도 그, 그 내, 내장처럼 저희가 어떻게 할수 있는 게 아니잖아요. 그럼 저희는... Everyone nodded, agreeing with what the student said. Uh, student? Have you never heard about drinking milk to grow big and strong? Milk is good for bones, so drinking milk, you are taking care of them. Also, not breaking them is probably, you know, taking care of them. But before he could even finish, finish talking, Mr. Eugene opened his mouth and said in a very determined voice, <laughs> 그러니까 노력해봤자 헛수고라고 하는 거다. 어차피 태어날 때부터 실패적인 인생. 그냥 대충 대충 살아. You sound like a nihilist. I can relate with that. <gasps> the class stirred again at Mr. Eugene's cruel words. But I felt more scared of him because of something else. He wasn't trying to be mean at all when he told us that all our lives are failures. Which means. He genuinely means every single word of it. It's more shocking that he actually means all of it. I suddenly felt distressed at what he said. The whole class was still in shock, but Mr. Yutin kept on talking. Despite you having praised Lance's bone structure. That brave student from earlier challenged Mr. Eugene once again. But this time he didn't even scoff. Beatrice I thought she was school equipment. So if you created her, she is your property. Hmm, that's confusing. 그럼 베아트리체의 모델이 되었던 실존 인물들을 좋아하시는 건가요? He likes parts of them. God, didn't you listen? 아니. 어째서요? 그 사람들은 선생님이 좋아하시는 골격을 가진 여성들이었을 것 아니에요. 죽었잖아. 네? 
Well, it's not like you can take the bones out of someone who's alive and still needs that bone. Especially if the bone is like, you know, the skull and stuff. Mr. Eugene sparkled his two eyes behind his scary, shiny glasses. No, that's not true. Beatrix as long as she isn't a glorious swan? Mr. Eugene looked sad. It was as if he was using his whole body to express his yearning for the unreachable. Please do not do that during class or in front of students. But at the same time, he was happy to have Beatrice. He's fallen in love with a magical being that can't exist. Everyone didn't understand what he meant and looked confused. But I can understand what he means. I like dolls with faces that can't actually exist. It's not that I simply like hot boys. Even if I say this, a normal person wouldn't understand and look confused. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that if you look around long enough, you would find a person who would have a face like a doll. That is how you... There are people who look like that. You just have to look. Sure enough, most of the kids had huge question marks on their faces. And I had time to think again after watching Mr. Eugene. If it's not a hobby people can understand, it's best to hide it. Mr. Eugene was about to talk about the pointlessness of life once again, but stopped after noticing something. Then he pointed towards us. He was pointing at Yunho and Lance beside and behind me. He raised his glasses and peered this way. Well, there's also two more famous transfer students and one transfer teacher who I'm sure also have lovely bone structure. I heard the chair creak and saw Lance standing up. And a bit later, Yano hesitated and got up too. Lance looked cold as usual, but sadly Yano was all tense. What is he about to do? I stiffened, uh, stiffened too to see Yonno get nervous. I know it doesn't make sense, but he hasn't figured out that they were dolls, right? Ah, 이상하군. 이런 골격은 처음이야. 이건 마치 누군가 인위적으로 만든 듯한. 아, 그래. This time I saw even Lance flinch. Mr. Eugene? No way! I became desperate thinking the boys might get exposed at this unexpected moment. Uh, even if you say you're dolls, I don't think people are going to believe you all that easily. No way. I have to divert his attention somehow. I should, uh... I was about to stand up from my seat, but at that moment... Thank 
그중 2학년 M반을 추천합니다. 왜냐하면 거기에는 신이 만든 또 하나의 완벽한 피조물인 테이와 레드 선배가 계시는데... 음. 아, 죄송합니다. 너무 흥분한 것 같군요. s i m b i stood up and dragged Soy outside. Soy r i t h e d and screamed. 이건 놔! 선생님! 제발 잊지 마세요! 엠반의 태희 선배와 같은 수업을 받고 싶단 말이야! 신비 이거 놔! Soy's screen got further away and someone kindly closed the classroom door. 도대체 이 아카데미에서 학생을 선발하는 기준이 뭐지? They had to ask com... Mal to ask? You know, first come, first serve? Well... I'm actually more curious about how it chooses its teachers. 아까 잘 말하면 테이 선배와 같은 수업을 들을 수 있었는데, 에이, 신비 너 때문에 다 망쳤잖아. Shouldn't you thank her for saving you? What? Nothing. I didn't say anything. I played innocent and avoided her gaze. So I was still fuming and burning with determination. Class was over a long time ago, but she was still hyper. That medicine... She might really need it. Uh, is it after school? You're shooting laser beams. I didn't know you were that interested in tea. It's not tea she likes, it's tay. So I quickly turned her head and held up her finger. Oh, I see. You don't care about tay, you just have a fetish for hot guys and waiter uniforms. I'm sure the internet has what you want. What? Garusong. 거기 카페 종업원들이 가르송 옷을 입고 일한다고 해. 소희가 소식을 듣고 아침부터 가르송 모습을 기록으로 남겨야 한다고 엄청 수선을 피워댔어. Uh, the the portrait didn't actually look like it was a suit. It certainly was, you know, a a shirt and a vest, but not flat-out suit like what Yuri wears. The cafe is famous for that. 자, 빨리 빨리 움직여. 이러다가 테이 선배를 다른 애들한테 뺏기겠어. 경쟁자들이 카페를 점령하기 전에 얼른 가자. No offense, but if he's that popular and so many girls know about it, I think women who already graduated from school but haven't found a job yet. Like me, uh, would probably be at the cafe earlier than you could get out of school. Then again, most of them probably have better things to do than to just sit there and stare at a hot guy. So I clenched her fist and walked in front of us as if leading an army. I knew that the cafe was pretty unique, but I never thought they'd make raiders wear suits as uniforms. Hey, in a suit. I kind of want to see it too. Oso seo. Ah, was on there? Annyang Shion. Only t a s e on bed, c h i g u n s a The waiter soy called s i o n looked like a cat. That's the first time I've heard you, uh, describe him as that. He was so cute the way he grinned. Eh, Yono is cuter. Calling him by his name... Does Soi know him? <laughs> 역시 테이군을 찾으시는군요. 역시라니? 오늘 방문하시는 분들마다 테이군이 있는지 물어보셨거든요. 치, 한달 늦은 건가? 아, 걱정 마세요. 테이군은 지금 심부름 갔거든요. 아마 조금 있으면 도착할 테니까 만날 수 있을 거예요. 진짜? 신난다. 일단 자리로 안내해 드릴게요. 절 따라오세요. 
여기 앉으세요. Uh, thank you. 음료는 어떤 걸로 하시겠어요? Not the triple Z. The waiter called g i o n handed me the menu. Uh, um, ah, this. Triple Z. I found a familiar tea in the menu and pointed at it with my finger. 네, 알겠습니다. 나머지 두 분은요? Secret Garden. 이하 동문. <웃음> 네, 알겠습니다. 아, 그럼 지지지 한 잔과 시크릿 가든 두잔 주문 받았습니다. 뭐 다른 메뉴는 추가하시지 않으셔도 괜찮으신가요? 음, 어쩌지? 당근 케이크가 먹고 싶기는 한데 다이어트 중이라. Wait, I didn't know Soy was on a diet. s e o n looked surprised too. 네? 하나도 안 뚱뚱하세요. 오히려 마르셨는데 다이어트라뇨. Yeah, so you only look uh, fat because you have very nice big breasts. And quite honestly, they make you give you a very nice curvy figure. No need to diet at all. Ay, 참, 아니야. 겉으로 보기에만 그래. 속으로는 얼마나 쪘는데. Excuse me, your uniform consists of a skirt. A pretty short one. It's not like you are wearing flabby long pants and a bulky sweater or anything. Hmm, I don't know. Ah, no, no, no. Of course, there was a reason she said she's on a diet. She wanted z i o n to say that she's sin. It was just so wonderful to see Zoe, Zoe manipulate z i o n into saying what she wanted to hear. But actually, z i o n really seemed to mean it. 정말로 잘 모르겠어요. 그리고 과도한 다이어트는 몸에 안 좋은데. 맞아. 쉬운 말이 정답이야. 과도한 다이어트는 보기 흉해요. No one said anything about an extreme diet. Wow. So tall. I could tell just from a glance that the man was as tall as Yuri. How tall is Yuri? It might be because I'm sitting down, but he seemed so tall I felt like his voice rang downward. His rolled up sleeve, half r o o m glasses, and his long hair and a natural ponytail, it all suited him. He looked so good in his uniform. 안녕하세요, 호빈 점장님. Huh? Soy said hi first. She knows j i o n and the manager too? How? 안녕 아가씨들. 오늘 온 이유 역시 이 아가씨 때문인가? 맞아요. 소희 등살에 밀려서 왔어요. <웃음> 젊어서 좋군. Well, theoretically, I would have uh, dragged them here to begin with, but Soi found out first, so. But Soi, Shinbi, you guys came here before? 응, 여러 번. What? Why didn't you tell me? I was going to go with them, but s o y and Shimbi came here without me. 무슨 소리야? 그때 너 바쁘다고 했잖아. When? When? I don't remember. Shimbi, 너도 있었지? 응. 네가 거절해서 s o y 랑나 둘만 왔었어. 그래서 시온과 호빈 점장님과도 친해졌지. 그때는 물론 테이 선배가 여기서 일하는 줄 몰랐었고. I really don't remember. 당연하지. 내가 찢었으니까. What? I I heard a voice just now. 너왜 그래? The voices in my head tell me I have to kill you. Ah, uh, I came back to my senses and realized everyone was looking at me. Ah, uh, it's nothing. Am I too tired? I think you would be if you keep chugging down Triple Z that much. I mean, off and on, you know, that's okay. I don't want to make things awkward, so I should let it go for now. Anyway, z i o n and Mr. Hobin, this cafe is full of hot guys. No wonder Tay works here.
It was obvious why Tay was hired. Yeah, who cares, you know, for you to hire someone who actually knows what they're doing or has the proper skill to even add something new to the work field? No, 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 no. You need to be hot. The suits as uniforms in a cafe only hot guys work at? They were definitely aiming for girl customers. Uh, I'm pretty sure that uh, clothes like they are wearing are also worn in the Indian restaurant I go to rather often. You know, at least once a week. And I can tell you, I'm pretty sure they're not doing it to get uh, female customers in. They're doing it because it looks professional. Goodbye, Shion. 넌 주문을 받으러 갔으면서 립 서비스를 해? 고객님께 조금 더 적극적으로 메뉴를 추천해야지. 이러다가 적자 나겠다. Quite honestly, I don't want to want someone to tell me enthusiastically about a drink. I want to look at the menu, look at the descriptions if I don't know what it is, and then I might try it if I'm curious. I don't want a guy to tell me, "Oh my God, you really totally have to try, you know, try this out. This is totally like awesome." Because tastes are different. Lip service, right? No, 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 he said I found you soaked in the rain while talking to Zion. Hmm, wonder who he could mean. <laughs> Zion made a fuss about not letting the manager continue his story. But Mr. Hubin Grinham playfully suppressed Zion. <laughs> 예전부터 우리 카페에 자주 놀러 오는 아이였거든. 처음에는 차를 좋아해서 오는가 싶었는데 알고 보니까 목적은 저거였어. 하프? 그래. 우리 집은 할아버지 때부터 커피 공부를 하고 있는데 내가 카페를 차리자 할아버지께서 저 하프를 물려주셨어. 할아버지께서는 바리스타이실 뿐 아니라 하피스트이기도 하셨거든. 지금은 이렇게 카페 장식용으로 진열되어 있지만 예전에는 꽤 자주 연주하시곤 했지. 아무튼 그렇게 매일같이 오던 녀석이 어느 날부터인가 통 오지를 않는 거야. 그래서 어찌 된 일인가 궁금해하던 차에 비가 오는 날이 녀석이 가게 앞에 you kind of started talking in a much quieter voice. Please speak up. 진짜? 근데 저기 그게 오랜만에 하프를 버리고 카페에 왔는데 카페가 닫혀 있어서 그날은 일이 좀 있어서 카페를 늦게 여는 날이었단 말이지. 비에 홀딱 젖은 꼴로 날 보자마자 덥석 안겨서는 여기서 일하게 해달라고 사정을 하는 거야. I think I read a yoi once that had a plot like that in the beginning. 그때 내가 얼마나 놀랐는지 알아? 하지만 그 방법밖에는 생각나지 않았단 말이에요. 하프를 보려면 하프는 너무 비싸서 사는 건 꿈에서나 가능한 일이니까요. 아, 하프가 비싸다는 건 옛날 이야기고 요즘은 그렇게 비싸지도 않아. 네? 바보. 가격이나 제대로 알아보고 부탁을 했어야지. Or you could have gone online and looked up harps yourself and then realized, hey, I'm actually earning money in a cafe and if I save up, I can get one. Really? Harps aren't that expensive nowadays? I don't know, last time I read about a harps prize was like $20,000, but... I think that harp had been that person's ownership for several years, so it was probably bought at a time when they were more expensive. 
그래도 정말 놀랐어 저 하프가 그렇게 예쁜 소리를 낼 줄은 몰랐거든 누가 연주하나요? 그래 여기 이 녀석이 말이야 말로만 좋아한다고 하는 건 아니었더라고 내 귀에도 꽤 듣기 좋았으니까 이 녀석 꽤 솜씨가 좋아 uh, Guys, I am on t a s route, right? Uh, where's t a 비행기 그만 태우세요 이러다가 또 금방 놀리실 거면서 No, seriously, why are we talking about the side characters when I'm trying to get one of the main characters' route? <웃음> 비행기는 아니야. 그냥 느낀 대로 말한 것뿐이야. Like I said, unless it turns out that Zeon and Hobin are also Kobe dolls that came to life, I'm starting to not see the point of them. Wow, s h o n i 연주하는 하프라니 보고 싶다. 볼수 있어요? By the way, I'm getting kind of thirsty over here. Can we get our drinks, please? Ah, 아, 지금은 곤란해. 이 녀석 한번 연주를 시작하면 너무 몰입해서 멈추지 않고 계속하거든. 그래서 영업 중엔 되도록 자제를 하라고 해뒀지. 하지만 언젠가 기회가 되면 볼수 있을 거야. 에이, 아쉽다. 그래도 틈틈이 하프를 닦을 수 있는 것만으로도 행복해요. He looked like he was in love. Oh, great, another freak who is in love with an inanimate object. You must really like the harp. 네, 물론이죠. It was so lovely the way he honestly talked about what he likes. He's innocent, but not quite like Yano. I smiled to think of Yano as well. 다녀왔습니다. Dude, where the fuck you been? I haven't seen you in like 50 minutes. Well, almost. Oh, Tay 선배. The cafe stirred as soon as Tay stepped in. Particularly the girls who came to see him. Oh. Tay glanced around to look for the manager in Zion and found our table. Tay and I caught eyes. 맞았구나. I wanted to beam back, but there were too many people glaring at me. I gave a small smile and awkwardly said hi. Uh, Tay, hello. Tay, 아는 사이야? 조금요. 그리고 혹여나 괜한 소리 하지 마세요. 심부름 시키신 거 가져왔으니 확인해 보세요. 그래. 이제 이 아저씨는 다시 일터로 돌아가지 뭐. 이 뒤는 젊은이들에게 맡기마. 그럼 아가씨들 좋은 시간 보내십시오. Once again, you're using a quieter voice. Please stop that. The manager said goodbye and disappeared towards the kitchen. 그래서 차는 시켰어? Yes, I've been waiting for them for like eight minutes. 아, 네. 저, 저, 저희는 시크릿 가든이고 이 아이는 지지지로. 역시 그걸 시켰구나. 좋아할 줄 알았어. 조금만 기다려. 내가 차 가져다 줄게. I swear Triple Z has Cody in it. 잠깐만요, 테이군. 이 테이블은 제 담당이에요. Tay checked the order sheet and was about to leave when Zion stopped him. But Tay didn't blink once and quietly told him. 보안이 주문을 받아놓고 또 손님과 잡담을 한것 같은데요? 아, 아, 그, 그래도 제가 일단은 선배인데. 저쪽 테이블에서 시온 씨를 열심히 찾고 있네요. 자, 어서 가봐요. I'm pretty sure they were asking for you, Tay. 아, 아, 밀지 마요! As the young suddenly came into their sight, the girls on the table shrieked and beamed. 그럼 잠시만 기다리세요, 아가씨들. 차를 가지고 돌아오겠습니다. The world of cafe waiters is total cutthroat. And before turning around, he looked at me and gave me a small smile. Uh, 
My heart beat fast at that amazing smile. Uh, is it because I'm seeing him working right now? It looks okay on him. It's a minor pet peeve I have with majority of the portraits in this game. Too many usages of purple, mauve, pink. How about some other colors? Heart spilled out of Soy's eyes. She then suddenly turned to me, grabbed my hands, and swayed them. So I looked around the other gloomy tables and put on her proud face. <laughs> I'm glad I helped, but you seem to be close with the other workers. The manager and Zeon, you were both friendly with them. I'm not the only one with memory issues in this game. You called them by their names and all that. Aren't you close with them? What? I can't call them by their names when I've just met them. 자, 여기 주문한 차 나왔습니다. 쿠키는 안 시켰는데. Yeah, we were thinking of ordering cake. 알아. 이거 계산은 내가 하는 거니까 걱정 말고 먹어. 진짜요? 감사해요, 태희 선배. Oh, but so I thought you were going on a diet because you know you're so so fat. I sent Soi's eyes shooting hearts again. 그러고 보니 너희가 이 아이랑 친하다던 그두 명인가 보구나. 이름이 뭐니? 네? 아 네. 저전 소이 이 아이는 신비라고 해요. 저저 저, 저는 이 아이랑 같은 엠반이고요. 반장을 맡고 있어요. It was very strange to see Soi be so nervous. Her hands were even trembling. She even faced Mr. Yujin, but I never realized there was this side to her. She did say she likes him. She must meet it this time. Unfortunately, since I'm on Tay's route. Yeah. It was cute the way she got nervous in front of the person she had a crush on. 그렇구나. 앞으로도 이 아이랑 친하게 지내죠? 네, 물론이죠. 걱정 마세요. <laughs> Let's see that after graduation. <laughs> Tay was trying to be the mom again, but the table beside us cried out for him. Tay waved towards him and looked sorry. Tay mouthed, It's hot, so be careful to me, and left in a hurry. Of course it's hot, it's fucking fresh tea! Like, seriously, Tay, uh, how stupid do you take me for? That's called common courtesy. Yeah, please take the ice prince. I don't ever want to be reminded of his route. 물론 왕자와 병아리도 좋지. 왕자는 쌀쌀맞긴 하지만 그래도 쿨해서 멋있고 병아리는 당장이라도 납치하고 싶을 정도로 귀여우니까. I thought for a second whether I should text Yono and tell him to avoid her. 하지만 태희 선배는 조금 달라. 
왕자와 병아리는 관상용으로 좋다면 태희 선배는 그야말로 남자라는 느낌이야. Then he should take a look at Yuri. He's even more of a real man than Tay. And he has dark hair. Eye candy is a bit harsh. I felt bad for Yono and Lance, who suddenly turned into things good to look at. They're dolls. That's what their main purpose is. No, actually, being Iron Candy might be better for their safety. I don't know about Yono, but if you say that in front of Lance, you're gonna be in big trouble. Oh. Ah, 방금 소리를 들어서요. 고양이요. Oh yeah, that scene that didn't occur in this route because we skipped it. 미안해요. 하지만 주인을 꼭 찾아주고 싶었어요. 왜 그래? No, I'm just suddenly dizzy, and I feel weird. 이상한 느낌? Yeah, as if something like this happened before. What is this feeling? Yano? 병아리? 병아리가 왜? 너 괜찮은 거야? 어머, 얘좀 봐. 갑자기 떨고 있어. 괜찮아? My head hurts and I feel dizzy. I feel like something strange is flowing inside my body. It's as if my head's caught up in a storm. What I was seeing seemed familiar, but strange at the same time. What... what is this feeling? I think most people call it déjà vu. I looked around at the sudden déjà vu. Eh, uh, you know the term and you asked about it? Ah. Uh -huh. While feeling dizzy, I saw Mr. Hobie leaving the cafe with a cat in his arms. That cat... I've seen it before. 괜찮아. 몸이 안 좋은 거면 일어날까? Huh? What? Uh, no. The the cat. 저 고양이? 호빈 짬장님이 거둔 둘 고양이잖아. 이름이 존이래. 무슨 이름의 약자였는데? 플레임은 말하지 않는 편이 좋아. 아무튼 너 몸이 안 좋아 보이니까 얼른 이것만 마시고 집에 가자. By the way, Johnson is a last name. So what? Are we never supposed to name the full names of the Mr. and Mrs. Johnsons? So I said that and drank the rest of her tea all at once. Sorry, it's my fault. 아니야. 카페는 다음에 또 오면 되지. 신비 말이 맞아. 그것보다 네 몸이 우선이지. 좋아, 그럼 나가볼까? You know, somehow the background music sounds like as soon as I step out, I'll enter the final dungeon and I'm about to face the dragon gatekeeper. I felt sorry to see Soy and Shinbi leave in a hurry. Anyway, what did I remember just now? I already knew that Yono was related to that cat somehow. But this memory didn't feel like mine. The Eri in the first arc was the real one and we're a copy doll taking her place? Or the other way around? Then whose is it? No, what am I thinking right now? The more I thought, the stranger I felt. I felt a bit nervous. Am I okay? 그럼 우리는 있죠. Really? I have to take the bus there, so I'll go that way. 혼자서 괜찮겠어? Don't worry. Shinbi worried about me until the end. She kept looking anxious. But thankfully, so I calmed her down. 그래. 무슨 일 있으면 연락하면 되지. 무사히 들어가고 내일 보자. 안녕. Yeah, bye. I felt bubbly to see her like that. I headed to the bus station after parting with them. 
Let's see. Uh, the bus that goes home. Ah, five minutes left. I got off the bus and was walking towards the house. I turned around at the voice and saw Tay. He seemed to be out of breath. Ugh, you scared me. Tay, how did you... And you didn't tell me on the bus that you were on the same bus as I was? Creepy. His hair damp with sweat told me he ran to catch up with me. Did you hurry because of me? I thought of telling you before leaving, but I didn't want to bother you with your work. I felt strange and had a deja vu that kind of made me feel nauseous, so... Maybe I should not drink that triple Z anymore. Hmm? Ah. Hmm. Let's get rid of that. Some I have the feeling the harp would get me onto a route for Xeon, but I doubt it. The tea was really good. Yeah, the tea that I've been probably not drinking at the cafe, but have been drinking for at least a week, definitely tastes good. Yeah, I thought this is the first time I tried it, but I love the scent. Maybe it was because of the change of location, but it did feel a bit different from when I had it at home. It was still really good, though. 그래, 마음에 들었다니 나도 기쁘네. 점장님이 가끔 주신다고 했으니까. Really? Wow. Thanks. I only drink drank coffee at home, but thanks to you, I'm trying everything. Okay. Thanks. Tay was so trustworthy. The sweet scent of the tea Tay makes for me. Just imagining it makes me happy. You suddenly disappeared. Tay sounded relieved. Huh? Oh, you saw? 보였어. 그대로 앉아 있으면 내가 변명을 만들어서라도 데리고 나가려고 했어. I felt sorry at realizing how much I worried him when he was still busy with work. I wasn't exactly sick. You, Soy, and Shinbi... Everyone worries too much. Tay? <laughs> Uh, sure. Let me get worried about every single bruise I find that probably came from leaning too hard against something, because that's something to worry about, of course. I was feeling a bit timid, but he softly stroked my hair. I looked up and stared at him. Tay didn't avoid my eyes and looked back at me. Why would he avoid your eyes? I was surprised at his suddenly changing attitude and just blinked. 그래. 어쩔 때는 너무 순수한 네가 부서질까 봐. Hey? 아니, 아무것도 아니야. 자, 어서 가자. Hey, stop being serious and instantly came back to his usual self. He was giving me his usual smile. What was he trying to say? I thought during the whole way home, but I couldn't figure it out. Oh, heroine, Izewa! So, 
뭐 둘이 같이 오는 거야? Yeah, I want to taste cafe today. 그러셨군요. 어서 오세요, 마스터. Okay. Were you watching TV? I said hi to Red and Yano who were sitting on the sofa and watching the TV. Yuri came out of the room hearing the front door open. 뭐야? 왜 둘이 같이 들어와? 오늘 테이가 일하는 카페에 가셨대요. Yuri strolled out and pouted. 내가 놀자고 할 때는 그렇게 싫다고 했으면서 그 녀석 가게는 그렇게 넙죽 가주는 거야? Darling, 나 삐칠 거야. Oh, don't worry, I didn't go on my own. I went with two bodyguards. 아, 아니면 그건가? 어장 관리? My honey, 역시 똑똑해. 맞아. 나는 달링의 손에 완전히 사로잡힌 한 마리 물고기. I am not a fan of fish, so kindly do not think of yourself as one or compare yourself to one, okay? Okay. Stop talking nonsense. What do you mean, hook? And since when have you ever been trapped? God, your jokes. <웃음> 장난이라니 애정의 표현이라고 해줘 하지만 어른의 장난을 마이 허니가 알고 싶다면 이네가 기꺼이 I know how adults spend their time with each other Playing video games together I absolutely love doing that 오늘 오너는 피곤하니까 그쯤 해두시죠 음란 선생 어? 무슨 짓을 했길래 마이 허니가 피곤한 거지? Because I've been drinking tea that is making me sleepy. That's why. Seriously, I think that thing, that thing is spiked. Yuri glanced at Tay and me and then frowned. 설마 너? 아니야. What was he trying to say? I feel like I'm missing out on something. 아무튼, my honey. 자, 이리 와. 내가 마사지로 오늘의 피로를 풀어주는 건안할 거야. 안 한다고. 아, 그러니까 슬리퍼 내려놓으시지, 은갈치. Lance, back off. I want a massage. 알아서 자제해 주시니 고맙군요. 그보다 다들 현관에서 뭐 하는 겁니까? 이웃의 폐가 됩니다. 얼른 들어오세요. Uh, yeah. Lance quietly put on the slipper he was holding on to. I felt intimidated and hurriedly took off my shoes. After a warm shower, I changed into my pajamas. I feel more tired than usual today. Even after taking a shower, my body feels heavy. <sighs> Is it because Tay worried too much? I feel more tired than usual. I sat at my desk to write in my diary, but... I felt the exhaustion suddenly get worse. I barely stopped myself from dozing off in the chair and thought of what happened today. The name was Banjul. The decorations were fancy and it felt comfortable. And Tay looked so good serving the drinks and food. Tay in a uniform. He looked so handsome. My eyes were definitely pleased. I loved the tea and food too. I'll probably go there often from now on. I'll probably get close to all the workers there, just like Soy. I thought of how friendly Soy was with them. It was Zion and Mr. Hobin. They seemed like such nice people. It would be fun to be friends with them. Yep. Tani? Oh, Tay. I'm not sleeping yet. Come in. As I expected, Tay was the one who knocked. Yeah, he knocked and answered, but someone else was going to come in. Tay opened the door and came with a cup of tea. 자, 이거. Oh, is it ZZZ again? 정답. 잠들기 전에 마시면 푹잘수 있을 거야. Seriously, I think you're spiking that shit. Stop it. Oh, thanks. He handed me a warm cup. Why do you keep giving it to me in, apparently, your cup? Tay's been making tea for me every day. He always thinks of me. I felt my heart grow warmer than the teacup in my hands. I enjoyed the scent for a while and sipped the tea. <sighs> it's good. The tea sent roams in my mouth. 
Thank you for caring for me every day. I want to do something for you. Is there anything you want? 됐어. 내가 좋아서 하는 거니까. Still, tell me. Hmm? As I pressed him for an answer, he thought for a moment and spoke. 굳이 보답을 하고 싶다면 말이야. Yeah? 지금처럼 그렇게 항상 밝게 웃어줘. 난네 미소를 보는 게 제일 좋거든. 힘이 나고 기분이 좋아져. <sighs> that is so difficult to do, Tay. Don't you know that? What if I don't feel good enough to actually smile? Don't you know that it takes a lot more muscles to a smile than to frown? Tay. 꼭 마음이 맑아지는 기분이야. 깨끗하게 말이야. You do that better than I do. I was about to mention Tay's nickname when he backed away a bit. Huh? 졸리지 않아? Oh, now that you mention it, I'm really tired. And as if he just cast a spell, I suddenly felt drowsy. Seriously, stop drinking the goddamn tea! My vision became blurry. Huh? Yeah, I'm actually sleepy. I rubbed my sleepy eyes and saw a smiling face in between my fingers. 괜히 잠 쫓으려고 하지 말고 얼른 누워. 이번에는 완전히 잠들 때까지 곁에 있어 줄게. Please don't start talking to my sleeping form. Huh? He'll stay with me until I fall asleep? So he'll stay in my room? Uh... 자, 어서 침대로 가. I feel a bit uncomfortable about Tay staying in my room after I fall asleep. My diary is there too. I kept hesitating. But even while I hesitated, my eyelids kept getting heavier. I can go to bed myself. You must be tired too. 말이 많으시네, 아가씨. 자, 어서 누워. Please stop gaslighting me. Okay. I was so sleepy I forgot my embarrassment and got in bed. As soon as I got into my comfy sheets I instantly felt myself falling asleep. I want to say something, but my body feels so heavy I can't open my mouth. I slowly fell asleep as Tay rhythmically patted me. Seriously, you're not being very subtle about this, Tay. Also, once again, an over hour long chapter. I'm probably going to start cutting them into separate pieces in recording sessions if the rest of them are really this long. So we'll see you next time!